Yeah, so for healthcare, the main problem was really finding, like creating an app that would be specific for the user um, and helping them, you know, with a certain aspect of their day-to-day -day lives. Uh, like researching a lot of the apps out there were really just monitoring apps, tracking apps, things like that. Um, didn't really help with like, you know, what the user really needed. Um, so a lot of us created apps that were specific towards that. Um, my specific app, it's called Epilane. It's uh, specifically for people with epilepsy. So um, people who are epileptic, at least here like in Texas, um, if you have a seizure at least once while driving, they revoke your license. And you're not able to drive for like another three months. And I found that to be a big problem just because it kind of, you know, it takes away your freedom a bit. You're not able to do much or at least go out much. Uh, you really need to rely on family and friends. Um, if there's not a good public transportation system, then you know, you can't really get around. Um, so with Epilane, the main feature that it offers is, um, it's like a, so it's integrated with IoT. All of our apps um, have an IoT Internet of Things um, integrated within it. And uh, for Epilane, it's a steering wheel. So it would be a steering wheel cover that measures your pulse and any slight moving, uh, movements that are associated with, uh, you know, any uh, uh, symptoms, you know, that are related to uh, seizures. And once that occurs, then it'll notify you to pull over, kind of direct you to safety, uh, notify people on your contact list or other drivers around you to get someone to go and help you quickly. <laughs> so uh, I started, when I started with uh, this project, actually, you know, I knew I wanted to do something with epilepsy in the beginning. Going into it, I wanted um, to help people with their sleep, just because that's another issue. They can't sleep very well at night, especially. Um, and so I did the whole design thinking aspect of it. You know, I went through the whole thing, like how would this person feel, like what's going through their mind, things like that. Um, and I ended up completely going towards a different direction that pulled me in a different direction completely towards transportation. Um, just because of like how I said, we wanted to get away from the tracking and monitoring and you know, something that has to do with sleeping would probably be more of a tracking app. Um, and we really wanted to do something more special that would help the person with, you know, and in, in out, you know, outside just with their life mm -hmm. other than just, you know, with sleep.